what is evidence-based practice methodology? What is it? Well, there's many methodologies around evidence-based practice, but when you look at all of them, they have some of the same attributes. And the first one is they look at finding the evidence, generating the evidence, being able to search it. And this is all done after you develop a good research question, a burning question that a clinician needs to answer to change care for a patient. The second piece is they need to appraise the evidence to see if it's good enough to put into practice. Then they need to implement the evidence to have it make a difference. And here's the key point. They then have to go back and evaluate the practice changes to see if what they've done have really made a difference. This is true evidence-based practice. And unless a healthcare organization is doing all of these pieces, then they're really not truly an evidence-based practice institution. The JBI methodology fits each of these pieces. Their first piece is healthcare evidence generation. And this is where they actually take a look at all the research that is out there. Their second piece is evidence synthesis. And this is the same thing basically as evidence appraisal. Their third piece is evidence knowledge transfer. And that would be the evidence implementation piece. They have evidence utilization where actually evidence is in use. And then during the evidence utilization piece, they actually go back and they evaluate whether or not the practice changes that have been put into place have really made a difference for our patients and our practice. Now, JBI is a group out of South Australia and Adelaide, Australia. But make no mistake, they are not an Australian-based institution. They are a global institution, and they have collaborating centers around the world that supply the information that is needed to do their job to help create and provide for you the absolute best evidence. So JBI has done an interesting thing. They've looked at all of evidence-based practice and they've actually developed tools and resources for each piece of evidence-based practice. So under Find the Evidence, JBI has built four resources for you to help you find the evidence. The first one is the systematic reviews. The second one is the evidence summaries, which are built from the systematic reviews. They have systematic review protocols, so you can go back and see how the systematic reviews were actually built. And you have technical reports. Under appraising the evidence, they have four tools to help anyone, from a novice in evidence appraisal to someone who is an expert in evidence appraisal, take a look at the evidence and synthesize it. The JBI Rapid Tool looks at one article at a time or one original research piece at a time. The Journal Club is a great tool to use if you're trying to teach an institution how to use evidence-based practice and kind of get a group involved in appraising the evidence. JBI Summary is a terrific tool to help build systematic reviews. It actually walks you through step by step. And JBI Tap is the tool that is used to appraise qualitative evidence. Under implementing the evidence, JBI also delivers quite a few tools for your use. The best practice information sheets and the recommended practice sheets are tools that can be used right at point of care by physicians, nurses, allied health professionals that they can read and then immediately put into practice. JBI has even developed a manual builder. Now this is a policy and procedure manual that is based on all the latest evidence from around the globe and it walks you through step by step how to do certain procedures and helps establish policies within your institution. The great thing about this is that it can be customized for your individual institution. The JBI Consumer Pamphlet Builder are basically patient education sheets that can be used to educate our patients on the latest things regarding their condition. And here's the difference. The consumer pamphlet builder is all based on the latest evidence. So you know as a healthcare provider that you're delivering the best information to your patient at any given time. And JBI Can Implement is a tool that is used by healthcare institutions that basically takes clinical practice guidelines and makes them applicable for the specific institution. Under evaluating practice, JBI has developed two very, very useful tools for you. And under JBI PACES, this tool is actually used by point of care for healthcare providers that actually appraise what they've done for the patient. They actually appraise the outcomes and the interventions in real time. 
and paces them, pulls that information together, and can let a healthcare provider or a healthcare system know how well they are doing when looking at certain patient outcomes, which is very, very important in healthcare practice today. Pool and Cool are two tools that are used to actually look at all the outcomes and then they benchmark your outcomes for a healthcare institution against other units within the institution or up against other institutions. Again, two very, very important tools because frankly, if you don't know if the changes you've made in practice are making a difference, that doesn't really matter. You're not really providing the best quality care. So that's what evidence-based practice is. This is what makes an evidence-based practice institution truly that type of institution. It's about finding and searching the evidence, being able to appraise it, implementing the evidence, and then determining if whether the implementation that you've done has really made a difference. That is true evidence-based practice.